All right. Hold on. Here's the deal. I did not wake up as early as usual. My alarm went off at seven. Started getting up, and then then I went back to sleep and didn't get up to like ten. And I wasted those first three hours of not being able to do stuff. So I had to start work then. I got two and a half videos done. It's super late now. It's like 4:30. Um, we're gonna run some errands. I'm finally gonna get this taken down. So I keep wearing hats everywhere, but haircut, more fish, Walmart stuff. I can't remember. We're gonna go, and then I have packages to open up. So we'll actually have an episode here. <laughs> here at uh, Napa because as you can see <laughs> my blinker is going like crazy front one got to replace the bulb so we're here at the bulb place so i was going to open the packages oh yeah spoiler alert i have one of these couch inflatable things that we're going to try out thank you Maddie for getting me it it came in the mail i was like I didn't know where this came from, and I had bought my aunt one originally, and I was like, oh, maybe she sent me one. And I couldn't figure out for a long time, and she's like, oh, I'm glad you enjoyed it. So, and I'm going to go test this out at some point. I was going to do it today, I might still do it because it's still kind of bright out. Oh, look at it. Hold up. You can see the lights, of course, field right here going. That's awesome. But anyway, oh, funny story about my his DJ Pay shirt that he got for his birthday and didn't even know he received it for a two months after his birthday. Anyways, um, we're gonna get frozen yogurt set and then I'll put it, put it in the one pocket that I never I used. almost kicked this. It was in your backpack. I would hold you. Don't be a car, that's funny. Um, we gave in and got Froyo and they had just full Twix bars and everything and Mario theme cups. And I found a bottle of wine. I love Prime. But I've learned, but I've heard, excuse me, but I've heard that with Prime, you have to be careful how a lot of things aren't the cheapest that way, and some people don't care, they care about the convenience, but I'm picky, so. I'm pretty sure these are my batteries. Here's the deal. This over. Lighting weird? It look better like this? Like halfway? No. I need like a diffusing thing so it's not just in my face. When we went hiking to Aspen, we got up to the crater and my battery was on one third. The battery system, the battery indicator on Canon isn't very good, obviously. It only shows like four bars, so by that point I had enough storage. I had a full 32 gig card. It's not a lot, but I had a full card still available, but my battery was quite low and I forgot my charger. I wasn't thinking it was my first hiking trip and I didn't know what to expect. I should have been charging it in the car on our way up, but at the same time I was shooting. So either way, I need more power, and I, and I need to not be conservative with how much power or storage I have. Those should be things that I do not care about, as I should be just shooting constantly to get the best footage for my movies. Not, oh, you know what, I need to stop shooting right now because there might be something cool in There shouldn't be that. It should be ready to go at all times. So this made obvious sense. Even right now, I'm at two-thirds battery already. Anyways. If I'm correct, this should be my two battery set. And I was debating so long, it was a dollar more for a charger that could charge both batteries simultaneously, which would be cool. For instance, I get to a hotel, plug everything in so it's not take out one, put the other one in. But at the same time, the other one had a car charger, but I think I can mod this one to have a car charger as well. So I can charge both batteries simultaneously and in the car for a dollar more. Box inside a box, how many times have you seen that? Of course, I had to do research too on how people thought or how people had experienced aftermarket batteries. I didn't really want to buy a Canon one again because they were expensive, so I went with Wasabi. I used the same Wasabi batteries in my GoPro, so I think this should be okay. Not the same batteries, obviously. Same brand. And I've heard Wasabi is okay because they have a few thousand milliamps, I don't know. I never use these, I probably should. 
Also, also, toasty ties. I've got a whole jar of them. I get one, I save it. Can use them for so many things. Right there, I had to put a new card in. It was card full. I can't get this plug in. What is going on? Cancel, cancel. Let's have a quit. These, these. Do you see this? They're all like jumping out of the water for no reason at all.